Hey drummers, it's Rob Lidden here from drumstheword.com. Welcome to this full video song lesson for my online subscribers over the website. Today I want to show you how to play the, the classic Tonight Tonight by Smashing Pumpkins, drummed by the genius Jimmy Chamberlain, of course. The tempo is 151 BPM and this is a tour de force of drumming really. We've got three very distinct sections with very distinct parts that Jimmy's playing, each with its own dynamics instead of challenges and coordination issues. So a lot of good fun but very challenging at the same time. And the ring here at the top, Jimmy plays stepped quarter notes on the hi-hat pretty much throughout the whole song. So I haven't included them in this lesson because they're not essential for the groove, but if you want the extra challenge, then Jimmy is playing a one and two and three and four and da and da, 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 da and all the da, da and da during the choruses as well. So if you want that extra challenge, you could be playing the quarter notes on uh, with the hi hat stepped hi hat foot if you wanted to. So we start off with this drum fill at the beginning: one and two and three and four and the one. Straight into the floor tom uh, uh, on beat one and one two sixteenth notes and one right left and the one. And then we go into the first bar, this two bar phrase, which um, he plays throughout this, this intro section. And uh, I had to watch him play it live to see what he was doing, but he's actually playing the bass drum and the floor tom together on all the eighth notes. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four, which is quite a challenge up to speed. Not impossible, of course, but your bass drum foot might get a little bit tired. If you find this a little bit too difficult, then you could just play quarter notes on the bass drum, but still play the eighth notes on the floor tom. That'll work just as well. It won't sound exactly the same, of course, because it's not the same, but it'll work just as well for you if you really find that bass drum uh, having to play all the way through this section um, uh, too tricky. So we get this one and two and three and four and, and then in the second bar of our two bar phrase, we get these two snare drum notes on the one and the and of two. One and two and three and one and two and three and then we get this drum fill starting on beat four four sixteenth, four sixteenth notes for the under one and we start softly ish but then we make sure we go into an accent on beat one of the next bar so we get one and two and three and four the under one one and two and three and 